we understand that you've got a fairly robust uh, product pipeline at this point in time. Could you give us a sense of the 100 odd products that you have lined up for launch? Uh, by when are these products likely to be launched? What is the sense? What, what is the update there? I can take the case of US because that, in any case, the biggest uh, market of the world and uh, contributes 40% to our top line in Lupin. Uh, as of this moment, as we speak, uh, we have almost about uh, 180 products uh, submitted to the FDA, of which 70 odd have been approved. Uh, we have about 47 or 48 products in the market. Uh, therefore, uh, almost 110 products await launch. And uh, as you would appreciate, uh, we continue to add about 20, 25 products every year to this pipeline. So this pipeline is going to remain, uh, you know, uh, uh, very handsome uh, for years to come. Having said that, uh, I think the quality of our submissions has progressively improved. Uh, and that's what gives me the confidence to uh, say that our profitability should also improve. Uh, 85 of our submissions, uh, pending submissions, are para 4. Uh, para fours are those submissions where you are actually challenging the intellectual property uh, in some form or the other, and uh, uh, and uh, we have uh, you know out of these para fours, almost I would say 13 billion uh, uh, dollar worth products are first to file. Mr. Sharma, I understand uh, Mylan has launched a generic version of your uh, Anthara. Do you expect revenues to be impacted? specifically in your U.S. branded business? Yeah, I, I think uh, uh, with the launch of Antara by Milan, there's already an impact uh, on the revenues. But uh, you know, the good news is that uh, with our very strong commercial strategy, uh, we have been able to hold almost 70% of prescriptions between our brand and our authorized generic. So... Uh, uh, to us, uh, that is uh, certainly uh, a very hard thing because uh, uh, it's not so common that when uh, generic competition comes, you're able to hold on to as much as 70% of your prescriptions. Uh, yeah, so, but definitely it will have an impact on the revenue.